NVIDIA's new DLSS 4 makes games run nearly five times faster than native rendering. This isn't just a minor tweak, it's a brand new feature called multi-frame generation, and it's built for the new GeForce RTX 50 series GPUs. The first game getting this massive boost is the free-to-play shooter, The First Descendant. If you manage to get an RTX 5090, you can expect an absolutely wild 226 frames per second, even with all the demanding ray tracing features turned on. The RTX 5080 isn't far behind, clocking in at 192 FPS under the same conditions. This huge performance upgrade is dropping with the game's Season 3 update, which also brings a new playable character, a massive new map, and even a vehicle to get around faster. But this tech isn't just for big blockbusters. A single-player indie horror game called Death Relives is also getting the DLSS 4 treatment. It's a super atmospheric survival puzzle game inspired by Aztec mythology, proving that even small development teams can leverage this incredible power to make their games run smoother than ever. This multi-frame generation is the next evolution of the tech we saw in the 40 series, and it's creating a massive performance gap. We are entering an era where ultra-high frame rates with maxed out graphics and ray tracing are becoming the new standard, not the exception. The power of these next-gen cards is just on another level.